Has WWE been teasing former champions' rebellion against Roman Reigns at SummerSlam? Piecing together the cues. Hello everyone, welcome to Back My America Sports Channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. The bloodline has been in a quandary for the last few months, and Roman Reigns has been left alone with only Solo Sikoa by his side. However, it looks like WDD has been devising Sikoa's uprising against the tribal chief, which might soon come to fruition. The company has been dropping subtle hints on the episodes of SmackDown for quite some time now. On the July 7 episode of SmackDown, there was turmoil in the ring, and Roman Reigns was lying in a corner. Solo Sikoa, who was the only man standing, was seen staring at the Eula Fala that was lying in the ring. Sikol picked it up as if it allured him and looked at it for a while, staring at Reigns at the same time. That was a subtle tease that the former North American champion wants to subjugate Roman and conquer his throne. WV dropped another hint at Night of Champions when Roman Reigns tagged himself in the match from Solo Sikoa, who was about to wreak havoc. This made Sikoa furious and he was on the verge of attacking the tribal chief. Moreover, Ronan held back the enforcer of the bloodline many times from hitting the Samoan spike, leaving Sikoa infuriated at times. On the May 19 episode of SmackDown, Roman Reigns accidentally bumped into Solo Sikoa, to which the latter looked at Reigns enraged. It is conspicuous that he is about to turn on the head of the table at any moment. Sikoa's vexation might finally culminate at SummerSlam when he betrays the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, leaving him alone on his island of relevancy. Factors that may drive Solo Sikoa to betray Roman Reigns Solo Sikoa has always been the lone wolf who prefers to carve his own path and deal with things his own way. However, he has been taking orders from the tribal chief, which has often exasperated him. Reigns is pulling the strings of the enforcer at his palms, which might prompt Sikoa to finally turn on his cousin and end his tyranny. One of the other reasons that might propel the 30-year-old to betray Roman Reigns is for the position of tribal chief. Solo Sikoa has had his eyes on the Eula Fala for quite some time now, which has been fueling his vehemence to aim for the foremost position in the Simone hierarchy. Moreover, the undisputed WWE Universal Championship has also been alluring Solo Sikoa for a while now. He has been protecting the holder of the prestigious title for months, and now he might finally want to have it. Thus, it is one of the factors that might drive the Enforcer to betray Roman Reigns, which is inevitable at some point.